Hey guys and uh, welcome to Ultimate Greatness and t today we have uh, Horizon Zero Dawn. Uh, this is the Frozen Worlds uh, ELC. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed the content so far. And uh, yeah, without further ado, we'll uh, kick off where the last one left off. And uh, yeah, we'll go ahead and uh, get us started. Alright, here we go. Okay. So we have... Yeah, so we pretty much have to kill these uh, fire claws. So we'll look on the map see where they all are so um because we there was one around i want to say around here that we killed so that's done because there was f five of them five of them so i don't know where the other one is but um unless we killed the f unless we we haven't killed no so i don't know where the fifth one is um because that doesn't make any sense um, but, at the same time, um, let's just like, weirdly over here or something, um, but, uh, was it New Quest? So there's at least three of them we know, so whether if the last one's a big boss, or something like that, uh, we'll probably find out at some other point, but, um, I mean this one's the closest to a campfire, so we'll go to this one. Okay, so... Well, I know this isn't it, but we'll take this guy out of here. Ah, there he is. Yeah, I don't know if, if it's the fact that we have to just kill a random five of them and there's just four random spots. Maybe there is an area where there's two of them, I don't know, but... But it is weird that they have four spots and we have to kill five of them. So whether, if, as I said, if there is one spot where, um, 
Well, let me just suck up real quick. I'm gonna say there is one where there's two of them in one spot, which I really hope not, but if it is, that's obviously what's gonna happen. Like, I can't change what they're gonna do, but I just really hope that, because, I mean, actually, that one wasn't that hard, though, but I don't know, it just feels like facing two would just be, like, too much, in my personal opinion, anyway. But considering we have to kill five of them, there's only four spots. Something tells me in one of them we're gonna have to uh, fight two of them at once. Actually, is there a way we can make this quicker at all? No. Okay. Yeah. I mean, it's not bad because we obviously have this. This, this guy helping us out, but uh, wildlife kill until we run something over. Um, okay. oh, one of these things again. We need to take out these Cybermen first, and then we'll take him out. Ooh. 
Okay. So, are there any others? Um, don't think so. So, um, you know, I want to travel to that, but we haven't been in that area. We'll go to this one. Uh, we'll do a quick save. Um, and yeah, all right. I will say though, this last one's making me pretty nervous because I just have a feeling that we're gonna have to fight two of them. Because this is the last one, like, what other spots are, are there gonna be for something like this? If I keep working my sphere in the cauldrons, maybe I'll have to write that. Really? How far we got? Fuck it, just run it. Just run. Oh, I should have used my arrow for that. My bad. Actually, we'll keep our arrows out just in case. Actually, we can use our. Do we, do we get a new one? <whistles> no, he's all the way down there. Just... Ah, oh, damn. Oh. 
stacked, it looks like. Nah, it's really not far at all. Oh crap. It was that pulse from the tower. Yeah, I'm just gonna keep on running. I'll show you a quick save. There you go, headshot. Somebody needs a kill, and I'm gonna kill. Talk. <sighs> Two fire claws. This is gonna be tough. Knew it. At least we have our attack with the side. I can help with those. We have to stop meeting like this. We will. When these are driven from our land. Get out of there. Can't ignore him. Two of us, two of them. More of a fair fight. Their numbers are much depleted, thanks to you. We shall end this threat and keep Cyan safe. She speaks of strange things, but slowly. 
She is a good teacher, and we are his pupils. Take care of each other, Artok. Farewell. All right. Okay, so all we have to get, all we have to go is here, and I guess we'll see what we have to do after that. This Banuke were dragged to Meridian in chains. Now Banuke and Karja live there as nobles. Okay, and yes, yeah, so I guess we'll go off to do the next thing. I, I heard. Aratak told me about Araya. I'm, I'm sorry, Nelto. No apologies. Aratak said that in the end she was filled with the blue light. She got what she always wanted, didn't she? Each time I doubt my way forward, I think I should seek her guidance. And then I remember. The only guidance I'll receive is my own. Which will have to be good enough. There's much to do. The fire claws. Aratak asked me to help hunt them down. It's a dire task. But it occupies my attention, so I suppose I'm grateful for it. My scouts have tracked them across the cut. Mm. I'd like to think you're right, Maltuk. About Araya getting what she wanted. I think... I'm sure she did. All her victories. Surviving the Karja. Communing with the spirit. Defeating the daemon. Every goal she ever set for herself, she accomplished. And in the end, she was rewarded with the blue light itself. The songs say that our bodies are poor vessels for the light. Our hearts are too dark. But at least for a moment, before she passed, I hope she felt what it was like to be part of it. You don't sound like you trust yourself to take Aurea's place. Aurea inspired. Whatever we encountered, the new machines, the slaughter at Thunder's Drum, we knew we would endure, because she had endured worse. I don't know that I have her confidence. Trust is earned, Aloy, even in oneself. You earned Aurea's trust, didn't you? She believed you were up to this, and so do I. Do you? I wouldn't have said it if I hadn't meant it. And I suppose I'd better live up to your expectations. Right. I've already found the fire claws, Naltuk. It's over. That's it then. That's the last of the Daemon's work washed away. The last notes of Aurea's song sung. The cut is a safer place to live because of what you've accomplished. And now it's time to start anew. I'm glad I could be a part of it. As are we all, Aloy. Thank you. It's me good to see you. Mm. Okay, so what's next? All right, so uh, obviously this has been uh, Horizon Zero Dawn: The Frozen Wilds. Uh, we have now actually uh, finished the series. Uh, hopefully, you guys have enjoyed the content so far. And uh, yeah, I mean, um, yeah, I mean this this. Uh, PLC definitely was uh, really, really good. Um, definitely uh, caught me by surprise how much content there is. Because, I mean, I, I very rarely did any of the side missions. And I think we ended up getting through, I think, 11 or 12 videos, something something like that. And uh, so there's obviously a lot of content. And definitely, yeah, definitely caught me off guard uh, how much content there is. Um, but, yeah, really, as I said, enjoyed my time. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, if you have not uh, checked out any of my videos, and if this is the first uh, series you're watching or first video you're watching, uh, I do plenty of uh, Let's Plays and stuff like that. Um, I'm hoping to have other uh, different types of videos coming out soon as well, so hopefully uh, you stay tuned for all of that. Um, but yeah, I guess for now we have now reached to the end of the video and to the end of the series. And uh, yeah, we'd like to see you all in another video. Thanks.